Chapter 3 If someone's offering is a fellowship offering, and he offers an animal from the herd, whether male or female, he is to present before the Lord an animal without defect. He is to lay his hand on the head of his offering and slaughter it at the entrance to the tent of meeting. Then Aaron's sons, the priests, shall sprinkle the blood against the altar on all sides. From the fellowship offering, he is to bring a sacrifice made to the Lord by fire. All the fat that covers the inner parts or is connected to them, both kidneys with the fat on them near the loins, and the covering of the liver, which he will remove with the kidneys. Then Aaron's sons are to burn it on the altar, on top of the burnt offering that is on the burning wood, as an offering made by fire, an aroma pleasing to the Lord. If he offers an animal from the flock as a fellowship offering to the Lord, he is to offer a male or female without defect. If he offers a lamb, he is to present it before the Lord. He is to lay his hand on the head of his offering and slaughter it in front of the tent of meeting. Then Aaron's son shall sprinkle its blood against the altar on all sides. From the fellowship offering, he is to bring a sacrifice made to the Lord by fire. Its fat, the entire fat tail cut off close to the backbone, all the fat that covers the inner parts or is connected to them, both kidneys with the fat on them near the loins, and the covering of the liver, which he will remove with the kidneys. The priest shall burn them on the altar as food, an offering made to the Lord by fire. If his offering is a goat, he is to present it before the Lord. He is to lay his hand on its head and slaughter it in front of the tent of meeting. Then Aaron's son shall sprinkle its blood against the altar on all sides. From what he offers, he is to make this offering to the Lord by fire, all the fat that covers the inner parts or is connected to them, both kidneys with the fat on them near the loins, and the covering of the liver, which he will remove with the kidneys. The priest shall burn them on the altar as food, an offering made by fire, a pleasing aroma. All the fat is the Lord's. This is a lasting ordinance for the generations to come. Wherever you live, you must not eat any fat or any blood.